In a fortnight after being sentenced to 10 years jail term in the Neeraj Grover murder case, Emil Jerome has now moved the Bombay High Court, challenging his conviction and blaming his former fiance Maria Suse Raj for the macabre murder. Pinning the blame on Suse Raj, Emil Jerome in his appeal has said that the motive of the murder, if any, was with the original accused, who is Maria Suse Raj, for committing the offence and not him. The appeal further states that the prosecution had not been able to ascertain the time of Grover's death and hence the possibility that the victim was already dead when Jerome landed in Mumbai can also not be ruled out. Whatever his filing, and I feel that is his right. Mm -hmm. And the court has decided that thing. Only by saying in air that the Maria is the culprit, it is not sufficient. And I, first of all, I had not gone through his appeal. His appeal. Okay, what the contention he is saying, whether the media is spreading a rumor or he has contented the same in the appeal. So all the thing has been given. Okay, even it's admitted fact that the Neeraj was there, but up to 115 he was alive. And there was a reason for Maria to murder her. On the contrary, it shows that he immediately rushed from the Houthis. And the watchman saw him in the morning. So all the circumstances itself shows that he committed the murder. He has discussed all the things. And therefore, I don't want to give any comments on that. Sure, sure, Mr. The court will decide on it. Law, the central position of the law is a matter of uh, matter. Appeal is a matter of right. Mm -hmm. The appeal is limited. The matter will be listed after three and four years. So what is the use for giving any comments or that thing? Where one where the higher court is decide the appeal on the basis of the evidence, whatever the evidence. And there is nothing in the evidence to show that, that the Maria, is, Maria was involved in any manner mm -hmm. for the commission of the offence. 